So Mart's moving on to Division 2. Let's go to 2A Division 1. That's where the Crawford Pirates were hoping to build on their dream season. Both teams came into this game undefeated, not wanting those streaks to end. The Pirates came out hot from the first snap. Quarterback Luke Torbert breaks left, keeps it, hugs the left sidelines, and escapes traffic all the way into the end zone, first six of the game. But Hollywood answered the call. Quarterback Rody Hooper hands it off to Austin Compton. He breaks through the middle, hurdles over traffic like a track star, and he's in. It's 8-7 Bearcats. Crawford comes knocking. Torbert hands it off to Cash Bellagiano, who breaks through the traffic and says, get off me, bro. 38-yard touchdown run. It's 14-13. After a Holly touchdown late in the second, the Bearcats go for two. Hooper looks downfield, fires it to the corner, and it's snagged by Will Scott for the tiptoe touchdown. Another six. Holly widens the gap, 22 13. They go on to win this one 34 to 20. Nicole Sheeran had a front row seat for this one. Nicole, tough loss there for Crawford. What did you see tonight? Matt, it was a battle of the undefeated tonight as Crawford and Holly duked it out for a spot in the Class 2A Division 1 state title game. Now, deep playoff runs are nothing new for this Pirate squad as tonight marked their second semifinal appearance in just three straight years. Now, it was a bloodbath from the first snap. Crawford started off strong, getting on the board first, but Holly's powerhouse offense took over. Bearcat running back Austin Cupton was a force to be reckoned with. He was an absolute tank on the field, breaking through every defender in his path. But Crawford never gave in. Senior back Breck Chambers faced an injury late in the second, but he came out the next half and left it all out on that field. But it was back and forth all night. A missed tackles and a late game interception sealed the win for the Bearcats. Now blood, sweat and tears were left on this field, and it's especially safe to say these seniors have left their mark out there tonight. Now this may be the end of the road to Arlington for this Crawford squad with a final score here tonight of 34 to 20. But Coach Jacobs was proud. These players should be especially proud. And this Crawford program is going to continue to be a powerhouse. All right, tough loss. Thanks for being there, Nicole, and they'll bounce back. That's going to do for sports. We'll be right back.